YouTube cover art. Ugh, I get the frustration. How do you make it fit for all the different platforms? It, like to have it on, on desktop, on mobile, on TV, like how do we make it fit? I've been there, I know your pain, I'm gonna fix it for you. So when you're first optimizing your channel, you wanna have a banner, that YouTube cover art, that looks good, that shows your audience who you are, what you do, and catches their attention so that they'll watch your videos and subscribe, right? But it can be hard because you need to make sure that that, that banner, that cover photo, is going to fit the multiple different platforms that YouTube can be shown on because it can be shown on your computer, on mobile, on a TV format. So how do you get one image to fit all of them? Now I'm gonna show you how, but also you can click the link below where I've actually created a full guide that shows you the dimensions and how to make anything fit, any image fit into that one image so that you can make it fit for your channel. So you can click the link below to download that right now. So first of all, you wanna have a banner that shows the essence of who you are and what your channel is all about. So if you're the face of your channel, there should be a picture of you. If you have a tagline or a slogan or a name of your channel, include that. Let your audience know what you're all about. If the videos are about business, if they're about cooking, have some images that show that. If you put out videos every Tuesday, every Thursday, include that on there. Have a call to action on, the, on there that says, click the link to subscribe, or if you have a, a website that you wanna direct them to, include that on your banner as well. Now a common and very valid question I get is, well, how do I actually change my YouTube banner? What is this? Where do I see it? How do I upload one? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into YouTube and you're gonna go right to your channel. So click on your name in the top right here and then click on my channel. From here, you're gonna see your channel from a front end view, how, how your customers are potentially seeing it. So I can see all my videos, my playlists. Now you're gonna click here where it says customize channel. So now that I'm in the screen where I can actually edit my channel, what you're gonna do is when you hover over your channel art, see if I cover, hover over this, I can change my profile picture, but I wanna hover over the channel art where it's gonna show me this little pencil here. You click edit, you can edit the links. Those are gonna show up right here. That's also really important to have that. But then you can click edit channel art. From here, this is where you're going to upload the photo. So this is something you can design in Canva. And if you need a tutorial in Canva, I also have one of those on my channel. It's the best tutorial on YouTube about Canva. Canva said so themselves. Upload from here. You can even go into your photos if there are any previous photos you've uploaded. Um, you can also use the gallery. You can see what other people have used, what YouTube shows, what YouTube gives you as templates. Um, and just upload one of those. There is also a link for how you can create channel art, but I've got you covered in that if you click the link below. I've got, I've got an even better one, especially because I've been around the block. I get this. So the other thing that I want you to do while you're still in here is go to your about page so that you can make sure that all of your links and your description, everything for your channel is optimized. Most people miss this part. So I've clicked on the about. I want you to update your links here, put in your website for business inquiries and description so you can make sure that your channel is optimized for when people come to see it. Because on top of that cover art that you're gonna put on your YouTube channel, people also wanna know what you're about. So make sure that your description, all of your about stuff is, is in line with who you are. And then also on the homepage, this like you can see how it says for returning subscribers. This is for people who are already subscribed to my channel. And this is how they see my channel right now. But what about for new visitors? I wanna make sure that they get the best first impression of me. So my first video that shows up here is a channel trailer that I've made just for them. So when you start to uh, optimize your channel here, you can click here uh, to, to edit this part and add in a video for you and create all of these playlists that will help people get to know you and what you're about and see your best content firsthand. Lastly, if you're not great at Photoshop, because I'm not either, I am all about Canva, you can go to Canva and use one of their templates to make your cover art. So go to canva.com, create an account, you can use a free account. I used Canva for free before I ever started paying for it. And even when I did, it was just because I needed more functionality. You can absolutely use it for free forever if you wanted to. So they have all these templates you can scroll through. 
Um, if you, you can pop in here, what would you like to design? If I actually start typing in YouTube, it will bring me up a template for how to make your YouTube cover art. It will give you lots of samples. You can just take one of their templates and replace it with your images, your branding, your fonts, your logo, whatever. You can use it. You can use Canva right here. And again, if you need a tutorial, go check out the one on my channel. It's the best one on YouTube. I'm not just saying that. Canva did. <laughs> they, uh, they really like my tutorial and I think you will too. So you can go check that out. But that is my best advice for creating your YouTube cover art because that's one of my most common questions I get. They ask, how do I make it fit? What, what do I put on it? And I get it. So I wanted to make sure that I put out a video here that will help you when you're creating your cover art because you're gonna be a huge creator, right? You got an impact to make on the world. And I wanna make sure that your cover art is just the start of that. So if you need a guide more hands-on, click the link below and I have my template that I've given you, a guide on what dimensions you need for all platforms. So you can download that by clicking the link below. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, comment below, and of course, subscribe for more weekly videos.